It's Reaper Day! Yeah! Yeah, it's a Reaper Day. We all love the good old Reaper, don't we? We all adore, cherish, and just just have great feelings towards our Reaper, don't we? Of course we do, and if you don't, then what the hell is wrong with you? Ugh, get slashed. Now, if you don't recall, for whatever reason, the Reaper is a default legendary boy, and his main mechanic is he collects souls as he collects these souls by killing enemies, he has a, a small chance to get them from normal things, but he has a guaranteed chance to harvest souls if he does his swap attack on them and kills them with that. Which is why, you know, if I do a little cheeky swapping right now, you'll see that his soul count should go up. I forget what, what did I leave it at? I don't know what I left it at. Hang on, let me... Uh, from five to seven, and then we even get number eight. Bam, right there. What a good lad he is. What a great time. What a good... What a good feel. Let's see. The 11th Finger of Lightning versus... Silphid. I'll take the Lightning, please. Let me get some more of these burn fragments. Oh, it's just so comfy, man. What a comfy, good mood. Now, Reaper's biggest benefit, you know... Isn't just the fact that he damage scales like crazy. And the fact that I get bullied because the dickhead has Brawler. You son of a bitch. You piece of ass. Oh, act one being act one. Act one being act one. It's fine. Uh, aww, 11th finger robbed me. Doesn't matter. The main benefit is that he has a lot of immunities. When he swaps, he is invulnerable. When he does harvest, he is invulnerable. When he does his fissure of the netherworld, he is not invulnerable, but... Point is, he gradually becomes more and more invulnerable and gets more and more damage. He's just a good boy. Leave him alone. Don't say bad things about him. He's a good lad. He means well. What the hell is that? Stop it. Ooh. Yeah, go on. Go nah, that's it. Yeah, die. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stupid, stupid mushroom. <laughs> Stupid, stop healing. Stop, stop healing. Uh, get harvested. Anyway, once you're done fighting and struggling and whoop, picking up Rockstar in the first shop, we need to keep building our damage up by getting more and more souls, make Reaper Boy all the more better. And maybe along the way, fight. God damn it, dude! Maybe along the way, we end up finding his best partner in crime, Bomber, who is good in some ways and not that good in other ways. He's mostly good because he enables very quick access to invulnerable swaps. Not as good because whenever you swap into him, normally your enemies die and he doesn't get to do the, the harvest effect when he swaps in and hits them and gets the souls. But that doesn't really matter too much because normally you can get enough souls just by playing through and killing dudes normally. I'm going to sell. Pick up the prayer. Pick up some bones. And now we're gonna move. So bothered by that man. All the items in the world. And oh, we get the Rockstar special version of the song. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Uh, hell yeah. No, don't do that. Get, get that out of the way. Now nah, it gets done, lady. You know what? Summon the ban. Summon the ban. Let him jam on him. I gotta do a Rockstar run again soon. He's such a fun- Oh! And everything was meant to be. On that day, everything was meant to be. We're gonna do some cooldown reduction for the Reaper, because the more he can spam his harvest, the better. No. I'm swapping in. No. I'm harvesting. No, oi. No, I'm doing that attack. I'm gonna open up the underworld underneath your ass. Please. 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 <laughs> Please. It's fine. All we have to do for Reaper is get his souls to 50 and then 150. Easily done. At 50, his abilities will upgrade one level. At 150, they'll upgrade again. This isn't difficult to do in the least. What most people want to do is get him up to like 500, 600 plus souls to get the really big, dumb, good damage out there. But we don't have to worry. 
little prick. Yeah, die. We don't normally have to worry too much about getting to those numbers because it's not necessary. It does feel good though. I will give it that. It does feel good to get really high numbers. But Reaper should do enough damage on his own if we build him correctly. Uh, take that, I guess. I don't really, I don't really care about the majority of what's sent. Fine. I won't forget to feed the ooh Medusa. I kind of want to keep Swanee because it was a gift. I would normally nine out of ten times take uh, Medusa here and have a a utility based Quint that can do multiple things for me. No, I'm not making an Oberon bill. Stop it. Go away. Go away. Um, yeah, let me give him some bone action going on. Maybe I take Mage and ditch Rockstar for now. Just to get those bones, dude. Just to get those bones. Ooh. A little bit of max life boost over here. Don't mind if I do. Nothing else here matters. Leaving. I got another mage run too. You know how long it's been since I did a mage run? Yeah, me either, dude. I have no idea. I, I genuinely think that Mage might be the one skull that I forget about the most in terms of whether or not it exists. It's a Land Wizard. Did you know his name was Land Wizard? I didn't know his name was Land Wizard. All right, Swanee. Pop off, Queen. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Fireball. But I shouldn't do that. I should get the swap and get all of those juicy souls. Bam! Now we're now over 50 souls, so we get the improved harvest. Yay! Which means we also get the improved nethers as well. Oh, it's the guy! Yay! Look at it go. Look at it do its nasty bullshit to this poor thing. Yeah, you want some... What? I think my lightning just hit it. Son of a bitch. Well, luckily for us, we can activate the fissure and then quick swap into our secondary skull. Eh, to get out of harm's... Eh. Get out of harm's way. Eh. Swap. Harvest their souls. Oh, dude, dude, dude. He's so satisfying. He's so satisfying. I love it. I love it. I might even keep little mage for now because having a swap that doesn't do anything and just... You can move immediately out of it. It's very, 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 very useful. Like, it is so goddamn useful, dude. How are you? Are you doing well? Are you enjoying? Are you... Are you also vibing with a nice Reaper build, maybe? Fireball, 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 fireball. Big swappies. Uh. Hit him with it. Uh. Yeah. I missed my fireball. 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 Swap. Bam. Hit him with it. Yiggs. Yiggs, we have to talk about this. It's a pretty good set and forget skill, the fissure, isn't it? Just like throw it down and just kind of leave it there. Come on. I just need you to get to phase two. There we go, so I can drop Swanee. And not do enough damage like I thought I would. God damn it, man. Nah, I got messed up because of my iframes. I had to dodge and I dodged wrong, dude. You ever dodge wrong? I dodge wrong all the time. Here, get, get some mana back, get some mana back. How do you end up throwing left, dude? How do you even end up making that mistake, dude? Uh, uh, uh. No. You know what might be a pretty good uh, inscription to chase on this build? Bone, dude. Madness bone, infinite bone. Mana bone. Bone of time. Bone might be the way, dude. Give me easy access to swaps back and forth. Yeah, give me some bone action. That'd be great. I think grudge stone here, I get execute an artifact to two, which would help set up collection desire a little bit and give me some, you know, some easy access to some, yeah, let's just do that. Some easy access to baseline damage. Very nice, very nice. I also want, 
<laughs> You're gonna hate me for this, but I also want silent cries. Melanophobia! Ah, oh, in Act 1, you shouldn't have. So the max life and damage of the dark enemies is increased. That's the big purple dudes that give me the cause. But my damage goes up by 10% whenever one of them dies. And getting it in Act 1 just means we have the most opportunity. This is like the, the medallion, like the gold metal box or the stone of the air, but four curses. So we do want this. That's huge damage. We also want collection desire and silent cries. Which gives me only one more slot left, which is okay, because it kind of takes away the hard part for us. I guess the last one could be on whatever we want, doesn't really matter. We could make it, you know, I want to say soul strike. Probably baby. Baby posture or last resistance, just one of those things, you know? Doesn't really matter. But the fact that we've locked in that many of our really important and really useful effects right away? Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. No, I'm not upgrading mage just yet. The plan is to try and find bomber if I can. So I'm not going to commit to the bit just yet and upgrade someone that I don't plan to use right away. Yeah. Watch out. Watch out, dude. Hell comes for thee. Hmm. No! 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 Fireball, 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 fireball. Walk into it, you piece of shit! Yeah, get harvested. Get harvested. Your soul is mine. Die. Alright, give me a legendary. Give me lots of bones. Lots of bones. Uh, Davy Jones? Can we say Davy Jones? No way! No way! No way, buddy, no way. That's impossible. That's actually so improbable and so impossibly just... How? I don't... Screw it, dude. Sometimes, you know? Likes me better. Likes me better. How about that? How about I just say likes me better? Yeah, that's right. I'm going to destroy this. I'm going to start being that guy that starts breaking every legendary quintessence I see in a shop. Because it's probably w more worth my money and my time than not doing that. I'm keen to find some bone, but I also kind of need some wisdom. I, I've got my two artifact. I could lock in one wisdom here and get my my collection desire buffed up a little bit. You know, there's some, there's some benefits and perks to this. Ooh, hang on, I need wisdom locked in real quick, thank you. Okay, so if I start destroying the things I really don't care about, I want to keep this for the artifact for now, I don't really care about Rake of Fury. I could destroy Rake, use the money to get... I was gonna maybe sell up some more and get Princess Box, because it is kind of nice. I don't think I will, because I can see myself replacing it, and I don't want to spend tons of money on something that I know I'm just going to replace. Like, I know I'm not keeping it. Here you go, bud. Yeah, you know what? Let's do this. Oh! The timing. The unison. No. Little lady! Oh, I got tagged. I got tagged, I'm it! Nah, doesn't matter. Mummy! I gotta do a mummy run. I got so many runs I gotta do coming up, dude. No. No. Perish. Good lad. Good lad. There we go. My goodness. I'm kind of excited about the mummy run. I like mummy runs. I don't know if I should do it as a skill build or a weapon build. I, th I feel like I do a lot more weapon builds than I do skill builds. Like just his his head toss and his, his poisonous mummy ball. Remember the poisonous mummy balls? Dude, I didn't even see you start that attack. Yeah, you're about to get, you're about to get swannied. You're about to get hit with the schmicks. Yeah? Harvest your soul. I harvest your soul. Give me your... Would it be rude? Would it be... Who cares? No! Fucking finger... Complete... Bro... 
Bro, uh, fine, fine. I guess we just live in this reality now. Now that I've got Bomber with Kaboom, I've got to make him unique at the very least. I could make him legendary, but it's not really necessary. It's a lot of bone fragments just to get Kaboom on zero second cooldown, which is really the only reason. The damage does get bigger, like everything about him gets better, but for 100 bones, I might actually, you know what? You know, I, normally I wouldn't, normally I wouldn't, but you know, for you, for you guys out there who are saying, please do it, Bomber deserves it. You're right. Bomber does deserve it. Bomber is a good lad. He deserves all this, this, you know, positive reinforcement and good treatment. So let's go down here and, yo, is that the head of the ascetic? I'm just going to drop, I don't care. I don't know anyone who does care. This is just, it's its just such a, you know, just do it kind of situation. Just go. Yeah, no, nah, it, it doesn't matter, man. If, you, if you're gonna just, just soak the hits, just take the hits. Take the hits, man, just take the hits. There's not that many, it's not that bad, it's not that bad. Hello, my guy. Be broken, my guy. Although, could you imagine? Ooh. Ooh. Could you imagine the double heretic? Ooh. Ascetic, I know. It's a joke. I'm now stuck doing it, dude. I can't do my funnies anymore because people are going to be like, Did he just say heretic? Yeah, I did. It's, it's ascetic, I know, but... That's because his damage is heretic. I... Come on, man. Wait. Oh! It feels so good. It feels so good. No, don't, don't, don't. Oh. Swanee pissed. Swanee pissed, dude. The coward's cape? Uh, I mean, I don't have... Yeah. I never get to use the coward's cape. Because I don't take it. Because I don't really like it as an item. But, you know. Oh. Thank you, thank you. A really, really, really good item. Thank you, thank you. Ooh. No, I don't do that. Do it. No, surely not. No. But maybe. What if I do? What if I just. What if I do it because of the meme? What if I just. Fuck did it go? I bought it, my money what? What the hell? No, there's no issues with the mods. There's there's actually no hang on. I'm gonna go and find the next item room and see because that was really weird. Like, normally I have to manually tell the game if I want extra item slots for all the like 90 item shenanigans and stuff like that, which I'm assuming is what tried to happen just there. Give me treasure to start with. Get some money so I can start making this build work better. Um, That's not what should have happened here, though. That is not correct. I don't quite understand. Why? Maybe it's not my place to understand why. You know, I'm taking an item room. I need to, I need to find out. If I loot this item, and because otherwise the answer is simply that there's something horrendously wrong with the Game of Girl bathwater. Maybe. Hopefully not. That'd be terrible. Could you imagine if something was wrong with the Game of Girl bathwater? It'd be shocking. Oh, so close. What? I am destroying this lightning. I am destroying this lightning. No, I don't care about you. Um... Yeah, it gives me the option to replace. Look. Hang on, if I pick this up. Yeah! Hang on. No idea. No idea. No idea. You know me, I would be very forthcoming about this. I use mods. I'm not using any mods besides picking up Reaper at the start for this run. I have no idea. If it was a mod error, I'd tell you. I don't care about stuff like that. I have no idea why that happened in the shop. It was just funny, I guess. We found a bug of some sort, a genuine one, which probably could be in relation to the mods being installed. I don't know. Doesn't matter. Point is, sisters. Heh <laughs> heh. 
Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Don't try and hit me. I'm the re Oh, okay. I'm the Reaper. Please let this work. Oh, thank you. <laughs> this is so bad, dude. Oh, I was, I was, I was gunning for it, dude. Did you see the cooldown on my swap? It was coming up and I'm like, please, please, please. I just want a kaboom. I want a kaboom to immune through. Don't think Harvest will be ready in time, please. Oh, it was so good. That was, that was nice. That was nice. That's a, that's a good fight right there. I think besides just getting bone and, ooh, my wisdom. Maybe I need to pivot into more mana tech. I've remembered and realized that improved mana tech is kind of disgusting and would be the best thing for Reaper. Like, I genuinely think mana tech might be the best, the best upgraded inscription for Reaper mans. There is nothing else of value here. I want to just get rid of you, I guess. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Make room. Make room for the wisdom. All right. So we've got... Yeah, the blood first. So Silent Cries gets locked in. What else do we care about? What what else matters greatly to us? Do we want Last Resistance? Probably not. Do we want... What's my dog barking at now? Ignore the dog. So what is... other people are out there. They could deal with it instead of me. Um, Baby... I don't know. Weakness exposure is not too bad for all the multi-hits that he gets with his, his fissure, but... I don't know if it's worth it. I think just taking baby or or resistance is enough, you know? Mm. I don't have much scaling when it comes to the power of my... Although Soul Strike wouldn't be that bad. 75% amp on my, my skills. Although Fissure will eat that, that charge, and so either my Kaboom or my Harvest, which are the two ones I'd want to get the damage boost might lose their chance to trigger it. Let's just take resistance and just leave it at that for now. Take it as some insurance. We're not quite at 100 fraggies yet. So let's worry about getting that for Bomber first. What do we got in here? Ah. Absolutely nothing I care about. Whoever could have guessed. No. Break that. Break that. There we go. Release me. Well, we got the full wisdom at least, which is a pretty good plus. Oh my god, move. Nope. Also, what a phenomenal time to mention and remind you that Swanee's attack and harvest kind of line up very nicely. Not, not perfectly in sync. But if you activate Swanee like a second before, it tends to work out pretty well. Yeah, go walk into it. Go on. Genius is over here. Yeah, see, I don't think I really need Legendary that badly, but I'll do it anyway for him. I just don't know if I need it. Harvest. I, that did 40 damage to me. Don't. Don't. Piss off. There we go. Look at that big burst damage, dude. Yeah, I saw you. Yeah, sit in it. Sit in it. As long as I can get my gate down first, then I can get my, my harvest to go afterwards. Easy. I'm only... Ooh, Frosty Boy was a good partner as well. Frost is like the budget version of a bomber if your main skull doesn't quite do enough. Ooh, there's Bone. Am I still going to try? I mean, I don't have anything really locked in. I've got spoil. I'm not doing spoils. I'm sorry. You might want me to do spoils, but I'm not going to do spoils. I think Bone... 
If I can get infinite bone, that'd be pretty damn sick. If I can get mana bone... It would kind of suck because I don't have double balance. Damn, I could have taken frost for double balance. If I really wanted. Maybe it's not time for bone. Maybe I need a very particular bone build. Maybe like basic skull. Maybe like... Yeah, maybe basic skull is alright for bone build. Or actually doing a frost run with bone. I don't know. Or Arc Lich. I could do... Oh, I could do Arc Lich with Death Trap in a bone build. Yeah, I might do that. Okay, okay, okay. That's not a bad idea. I'm just thinking up ideas for what I might do moving forward that aren't this. So... The Sphinx Eye is a good item. It's going to help us out a bit. And I think I want to take it and replace... I mean, I don't want to lose Mana Tech, but I don't want this Cog Wheel. The Cog Wheel is just not a great item. It, it's... It serves its purpose. Okay, now I'm going to let you know right now. Mana Cycle as a box. I never buy boxes, but sometimes when the boxes show up... Damn it. Sometimes when the boxes show up, you could get really, really, really good stuff, he says. Not this time, but you know, sometimes. Oh. Sorry. That's pretty funny, actually. No, go away. I want to open this. Thank you. Also, kaboom into Reaper nonsense gives him the sliding stuff the same way that Little Skull does. Look, you can kind of move a little bit. It's kind of weird. He's a little bit funny, you know? He's, he's a funny little guy. That's a lot of burst damage, my son. Stop that. It's such a visceral attack, man. I love it. So we've got the final, final, fi oh. We've got the final upgrade now that we're over 150 souls. Oh, that's bad for you. That's huge burst. I should have saved it all, actually. But now that we've got enough in souls, the rest does, I don't want to say it doesn't matter, but it doesn't matter that much. Like... Netherworld, like, effectively, they've just got extra effects. So for each kill hit with the skill, we get, you know, a damage increase up to 200%. It makes Harvest kind of a good way to open into a room or do, like, you know, big clears to get a damage boost, but... I don't really rely on it. The Fissure one is kind of nice. They take 20% amped damage, so dropping Fissure before you do anything else... is kind of the way to go, I guess. Like, you know, drop Fissure... Do some of this, do some of this. Everyone takes more damage, yippee. Drop a new fissure. Try not to get hit too much, despite the fact that I am. Accidentally do that right into his shield like a dummy. He was right about to finish doing his attack too. Doesn't really matter, because we're Reaper, and Reaper doesn't really give a shit. Destroy that so I can keep looting. Thank you. Eh. Harvest your soul. Well, damn. Isn't this a sight for sore eyes? Look at it. It's the boy Yaksha himself. And Wisp. Wisp is fun. I like Wisp. I like Wisp so much. But I've got Swanee. I don't need it. Um, yeah. That's that's a gift. Thank you. He's technically looking out for us. You know, he's he's helping. He's doing stuff. I've done, I've done my share, alright? I've done my share for the Yaksha community. I helped. All right, damn it, I helped. I did my video. I, I, I did my thing. I'm not required to do anything else. I've upheld my end of the contract. What I do need to do... is unleash hell. Goodness. Goodness me. I didn't think it would actually be this hellish. Like, damn. Bang. <laughs> I, w I, I mean... Mm, there's a lot of really broken skills in the game. I don't know. I still think if you were to ask me just... On a scale... Oh! Of like, duh to duh. I think, um... Harvest might still be one of the most broken, if not the most broken. Going all the way back to, you know, OG 
super ultra vanilla early access Skull the Hero Slayer when it was still just the, like it was always this. They tried to like balance Reaper a little bit by giving him the, the whole soul boosting mechanic so he doesn't get access to the really broken one straight away. Even though you become broken and then get even more damage on top, you know, soon after. It's pretty crazy. Mage's Necklace. Ooh. Do I want Mage's Neck? Hang on, I said I was going to do this. There we go. Become thick. No, just replace. Just roll it down, dude. Roll it down. Let's just try and find something else. Oh. 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 Okay. Oh, shit. I need that circulator. That's my replacement for my god. Damn it. Um, I lose heritage and I lose my... I don't lose artifact, actually. No, hang on. Screw that. Screw that. Screw that. Yep. Grab it. I know Lou is here and Lou has some wisdom on it. I don't care. I need to unlock this wisdom because we don't need it. We need to go down into four wisdom. I can put that into anything else. I can put that back into... Uh, well, anything, really. But I don't have the money for it right now. But we will do this moving forward. Damn, that was... That was like all of the best shit all at once that you could find. Ridiculous. Ridiculous, dude. Actually ridiculous. Insane. No. That was... Damn. Damn, what a room, dude. Damn. That's hard to grasp, just how insane that room is. I should still hit the guys upstairs. Did not hit all the guys downstairs, though. But that's okay. No, you die. You die. Look at the dead. Ooh. I mean, nothing else here really. Yeah, okay, go for it, dude. Go for it. Oh, I saw what Max Mutant did last time. I've seen what Max Antique does. I, I don't know anymore, man. I don't know where this build is going. I was going to do Bone at first, just, just on a whim, you know? I was like, yeah, Bone would be kind of funny, right? But I don't really need to anymore. Hello? Are we all just dying from falling into the... Damn, is that thing doing damage or what? Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot it was a freezer over here. I forgot it was a freezy poops. Die. Die. Yeah, what do I want to do? Shit. I don't know what I want to do, dude. I don't want to just do like normal wisdom at the end. Mm, done artifact, done mana cycle, done mana tech. I've done, I've seen mutant. I've seen all of these so far. Damn it. Maybe I do have to go back and do bone. I passed up on bone of madness though, and I would have sold bone of madness by now as well with all the other items. But maybe now that I freed up some room and I found some good cooldown stuff, maybe I do just, um, stop that. Oh, yeah. You see how silly this is now? The loop that we've got it stuck in? We do this. Then we swap out. Then we do this. Then we do this. Then we do this. Then we do this. Bam. Then we do some of this. Yeah, she's dead. It's, it's, it's ridiculous. And if I had even more mana cycle and, and mana tech, I'd have so much cooldown and so much more damage, and I hate this stupid thing. All it's done is troll me in the last two videos. This video in the last? Come on, man. Oh! I think I have to take that clone stamp. That's disgusting. Double antique stamp. Ooh. Yeah. Because I have, yeah, I have what we want. Okay, so all I'm looking at here is things like... Trans got changed. Decreases physical attack and magical attack by 50%, but increases physical and magical by 20% per second upon damaging an enemy. 200% tops. The effect is removed if you do not damage an enemy for 5 seconds. Ah, so it just builds up. So 
we start doing half damage, or rather, well, yeah, the way that that's worded, we will do less damage at the start, but the more we hit our dude, it goes up to a max of 200%, so the first 50% negative would still be in effect, so it's a plus 150. That's not bad. I don't think I want to mess with it too much, though, because a lot of what Reaper does is walk into a room and do big burst damage with, with like, a single harvest. But for dudes who ramp up damage really quickly, like rapid builds and stuff like that, that'd be really good for them. Like, that's unironically a pretty damn good take for a for a speedy multi-hit kind of build, or, or someone like... I don't want to say Mummy, but someone like Mummy could do very well with the gun builds and stuff like that. Werewolf, King... Well, maybe less. Uh, King can work, it's just... King's also a pretty explosive damage dealer, depending on what skills you've got for him. I think it's funny that these guys are just here now. We just have to live with the fact that there are adventurers out here, just little little explorers just chilling, you know? I was a little bit late. Doesn't even... I, dude. What happened to that man? Nah, you can walk into that and die. I'll let you. Come on. Nah. Also, it's a rule. You have to jump up in the air whenever you do... Just die. Whenever you do harvest, you have to leap into the air and do it all silhouetted and stuff, you know. Make it look aesthetic AF. Yeah! See? Looks cool, right? Looks way better. <laughs> aesthetic. Give me that. Now give me... Ooh, a berserker. I don't mind a little berserker. Guys, thick. There we go. I need to do the big combi. I need some more heritage. I want Swanee's cooldown to be lower again. We gained so much with that lowered cooldown. Now remember, I'm not focusing on trying to specifically and deliberately build up souls. I'm not... My, my care is not centered on that right now. So if you're thinking about it, you're the only one thinking about it. The point is just to see and show you that Reaper doesn't really need... I mean, you can. Obviously, you can. It's a big deal. Like, this is just me going through not trying, you know? I did maybe, like, what? Two or three deliberate swaps in the beginning of the run to try and... Yeah, right. You move out of it some. To try and show off a little bit. How tight can you do that, by the way? Am I, am I doing that wrong? Can I make that tighter? You can make that tighter. I thought you had to wait for him to at least do the swipe. So I could... <laughs> That's funny. You wouldn't want to do that because you're, you're eating into the iframes that the harvest gives you, but you can do that. Uh, DP, hello, how are you? Um, right, we need to go out of this first. Into what, though? Into what? Into what? Into what? Maybe I need to try and find... I've also got a dead treasure that's not doing anything anything. All right, hang on. Let me try and find one more thing that I can take instead. Just one. I have no money, actually. I'm pretty broke. I shouldn't do that. So let's... If treasure goes... Okay, so it's it's Relic and Spoils. Relic and Spoils are the only two that I can put into. Okay, hang on. Relic. And I can't afford... Fuck! <laughs> no! Doesn't matter. Fine, 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 fine. We're a bit broke. I'm a broke boy. It's okay. It's okay. Do some of this. We'll do some of this. Don't care, lad. He wants me to. He wants me to, alright? I can see the look in his eyes. He wants me to. Yeah, go on. Be scared. Be scared. Be, be fearful. Go for it. I, I salute you and your, your fear and terror. That is so funny, dude! I'm going to end up doing that unironically. Aha! Some heritage. Mmm. Yeah, I'll take that for now. Yeah, I'll appreciate that. Do I keep taking skull rooms or do I try and get some more? Yeah, we do. 
bones, dude. I'm a bone addict. I'm just, I'm all about the bones. So good. So good, little bumbaroo. I can even go up into the air and do some of that. I can then do some of the, yeah, baby. Uh, no, I swap out. No, uh, no. Sucks to be you. Dude, it's so... Reaper is just such a good time. Reaper is such a good time. I've deserved this. I deserve this after the Yorkshire, after the Hunter, after all of the trials and issues, after the Warrior run almost turned into a problem, like... And all the times that Reaper has blessed us in the couple of runs since the update. Yeah, I think it's necessary. Yeah, get her, get her. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, nah, that's 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 insane. It's it's kind of it. Oh. Oh. Okay, so do I want? This translates into damage. We'll finish getting max life increase and we'll translate this into more damage. This just turns into more max life. I guess we do this. The Unknown King is coming along and he's all like, Hail Death. I've come to, to, uh, uh, share in the bony goodness. This will get halfway there. About six. What is that? Three, four, five, six. Yeah. Almost. So, we only need four more, so we only need 60, so that's 49 left to go. We could totally make that happen. 60 total bones? Easy. Should have said so. I didn't do my bloody... There we go. I gotta do my gates underneath his, his leggies first. There we are. Cracker this open. Prick's gonna do his stupid lightning attack on the ground. Yep. Yeah. Wait, did they all die? Hang on, let me just drop this here. Let me just be an asshole real quick and drop that there. And then, yep, yeah, they all just die on being summoned in. <laughs> That's kind of funny. That, that, that. Oh, dude, that, f that feels good. That feels good. I like it. No, don't do it. He dies before all the effects can even hit. He's dying a little bit too quickly. All right, nine bones to go. Oh, he still clipped me at the end. He clipped me at the end. Fuck you, dude. Uh, how dare you clip me at the end of my cool combo? He was pretty tanky. He had a lot of, a lot of tanky stuff going for him. I'm more impressed with the cooldown stuff. No infinite bone and we're still getting away with this much tankiness? Did I say tankiness? The cooldowns. Why am I... Ooh. I forgot to sell stuff. I don't really care. I'm rewarded for not caring. I was gonna say, like, with everything that I've got, it's all kinda useful. I might get rid of the pocket watch. And then I lock in that one empty one that I've got with Antique. Or I can just replace the staff. But I get more damage this way. I guess the Pocket Watch's cooldown stuff is helping. It, it is making the difference a little bit, so... I guess I get rid of the staff, replace the staff with the, the new new staff, with the, with the ritual staff. And then eventually I want to replace the Magic Pocket Watch and then maybe lock in... I don't want to lose that mutant though. That mutant's really comfy. I kind of like the whole build right now. Damn. Maybe I ditch the prayer of... No. Mm, damn. I don't know. I gotta figure it out. I do like how this feels though. This feels good. Alright, last bone room. For sure, for sure, for real, for real. Because I should get enough bones even with just the... The like... Jesus! The little freebie extra bones that I get just from opening up the bone pile. Yeah, dude, that's that's a nuts combination. Yep, look at that. 62 bones. Didn't even need to break the boy. 
Hell yeah. And I can come over here and do this? Oh, dude, that's so good. That's actually so good. I didn't need to do that. I need to break this. Oi, 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 oi. Rude, not your fight. Not your fight, kiddo. Son of a bitch. Oh, it's the little girl. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. This guy's asking for it. There we go. We're doing 1,300 non-crits. Pretty nasty, pretty disgusting, pretty gross. Pretty despicable. I'm taking her stuff because otherwise... Otherwise, I won't get any... The bone came to me, dude. The bone. My mana bone. It's not the right one, though. I'm not doing the bone build on this. I'll do it on, on Lich or something. Someone else. I don't know who, but someone else. Okay, so I need to fix this up. I need to fix this up. If I ditch Wisdom now, my only option is Rapid, which... I mean, I'll get six locked in inscriptions so 150 percent damage from collection desire but can i find something else is the question damn i could take the voodoo doll for a four like if i if i took the doll got rid of magic pocket watch i lose the one mutant that that's it stings a little bit but doesn't matter too much i lose antique i change the wisdom i lock in four antique so i keep it I also gain four in Artifact, but I don't gain any extra Revenge. But the only other one I can gain extra in is Rapid right now, so... With an extra life, like Reaper with four lives, like Voodoo Doll, the, uh, the, the Last Resistance, Normal Life, one and two, it's kind of... kind of gross, to be fair. It's kind of disgusting. I could also try my best to boost up the Prohibited Book if I had this earlier. And could actually level this that'd be insane unfortunately i just don't think it's possible to get that done now um i'll accidentally destroy jones pillars while trying to do harvests i won't even do a harvest i'd have to use fissure of the netherworld and just sit in the middle of the room and let the enemies walk into it until i kill enough dudes to satiate the 500 hits uh torture not doing that i might grab this this just seems like a funny stupid haha -ha, go ahead I dare you, you won't, and we do it anyway. I guess this build doesn't have a new inscription that we're going to do. We might just end up taking one of the ones that we've used already, which isn't, you know, that's not the end of the world necessarily. We're allowed to do that. It's just I wanted to use a new one. I want to keep exploring and seeing what the new ones have to offer. Are you, are you just fighting nothing over here? Sir. But who's to say that a comfy, you know, a cozy Reaper run isn't something that we can just do and get away with? We can do that. We can get away with that. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, no. Remember when that used to be the mood? I remember when that item was like the item and everyone had it. Everyone wanted it. It was the shit. It's not bad, it's just, it's, it's kind of a shell of its former self. It's not, it's not the same, you know? This combo is so disgusting, by the way. I know I'm kind of eating into my iframes by chaining bombers thing into harvest. And I shouldn't do that against the more difficult boss fights like Dark Skull and Alexander, but for just nuking and doing a ton of damage all at once, it's pretty fun. If I had infinite bone or something and I could ensure my cooldown and my harvest was back by the time that combo finished so I can do another harvest. Oof. Oof. Please don't ruin this for me. Ha ha! The burst. La Bursta. That's some good deeps. You can't stop me. I'm the bomber. <laughs> uh, you can't stop me. I'm the bomber. I'm going to do the combo. I don't care. I'm going to do it. We do this. 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 Oh, dude. The damage is... The... Th 
I'm gonna say it, dude. I don't care. I don't care if it's a waste. It's friggin' fun, man. It's friggin' fun, man. She's doing it because she has to, because she knows she's fucked. <laughs> Uh, she put up a fight. She did stuff. She broke all my iced tea. She, she broke all the... Ooh. Kai. It is antique still. I mean, I'm, I'm not going to lose an antique if I do this. I might ditch the ancestral bracelet. The idea at the beginning was to maybe go a heritage thing, but I don't really need that right now. I kind of want to do this. And then I take out of Antique, put into Revenge, and we still win, either way. And now I've just got more- HOLY SHIT! I haven't looked at my damage in a while, and seeing over almost 1600, and I haven't- I've only got 276 stacks, dude. That's not even a lot of stacks. If you wanted to rig it, you could get way more stacks than that, man. You got way more stacks than that. Do it. Do it. Do it. Yay! Maxed out bone pillars. Considering we also maxed out little bomber boy at the same time. Although we did have reaper, so reaper's like the freebie, I guess. So. There we go. Bam! Yay! Souls for me! 285! Look, my damage is getting higher. I, what I should do is try and get a big harvest on as many of them as I can in the last room. Okay, so my plan was to take out of this and put into revenge, right? Pow. So we still keep antique. We've got wisdom. This looks pretty neat. Besides treasure. Artifact 4, relic 2, mana cycle, revenge, the one mana tech. Yeah! Yeah, this is kind of snug, dude. It's kind of... Kind of snug, if I do say so. Mmm. Comfy, even. Food's a one room, isn't it? Yeah. I could break this for some max life. Then again, I don't really care. Let me just do this for the fun of it. Just so I can see what's there. Ooh, stuff. Who cares, dude? Who cares? I'm leaving. I'm getting out of here. Alright. Harvest time. Stupid meteors. Just screw diddly -ood me. Let me get some of these. No meteors! Ah, oh, fine, whatever. I'll just take the souls the normal way. It's not that Harvest has a particularly high chance of giving me extra souls. It just looks cool when I do it. No, no, no. Mm. Yes. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. Yes. 300 exact souls? Hell yeah, dude. 2662, my wisdom is active, isn't it? Yeah, I'm blue. Alright, well, that's that's my damage when it's all maxed out with all the amps. I don't think I've got... No. I don't have any amps that work when they're low on life. No no execute and stuff like that, I don't think. So that that's just my max damage. Which is pretty damn sick. Not bad at all. If I come into the fight now, I should hopefully see it by the second half of phase one. Although I wouldn't mind, like, speedrunning through the first phase... If I can, and kind of just getting access to to it in the next phase instead. Yeah, see, here's where doing the bomber swap early was, is kind of handy, is overlapping effects like this. Because he's going to go and do this shit. I didn't know. That was kind of awkward. I didn't know how that was going to turn out. Orkies! Orkies! There we go. Is that a flawless phase one? Oh, my wisdom activated. I didn't even see it. I'm glowing, dude. Ah, uh, can I take advantage? I was trying to get through before it activated. It was a bit slow. I kind of, yeah, I forgot about the whole, you know, you have to do the dash flash nonsense. I put this here.
Damn, that goes high. What am I waiting for? I should just do it. <laughs> I kind of broke his attack. Feels weird. Oh shit! I thought you were gonna fire like like the little balls or something. I didn't think you were just going straight into this. Suck. No, but now you're gonna do suck. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was almost almost a problem. Damn it, I was trying to be cheeky. Quick, before daddy's ball sack arrives. No. Daddy's ball sack is here. Oh, it's dead. I broke daddy's ball sack. It's, it's fine. What the hell? Ugh. It's fine. It's fine. That is bullsack broke. It's okay. It's fine. Yay. This feels a little too safe. <laughs> this feels... This feels a little too safe. I just remembered I've got Voodoo Doll and the Last Resistance thing. Ah, oh, shit. And if I want, I can take Upgraded Antique. Ah, oh, shit. Wait, isn't Upgraded Antique... No, no. Upgraded Fortress is... No. Antique is the good one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fortress is the one that's... A little bit too specific on shield. I think antique is that I do more damage while I'm above max life, above the 70% threshold, is it? What the hell did it do again? I'm already forgetting what it did. Hello, ma'am, show me. Increased damage. Ah, that's right. What did we say this was? 500% is the max cap, so I wouldn't get, a, like, the most if I took this. I definitely get more if I just took wisdom. It's it's an amplifier. It's it's better. It's an amplification effect versus a increase effect, which even then, if the maximum number is 150, that's okay, but we're literally um getting the same thing from collection desire right now. I mean it'd be nice, but considering what our numbers are already like. An amp is just way, 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 way more impactful to us. So unfortunately, we're just going to go the basic bitch wisdom route. But that's fine. That's fine. I am really curious about bone build, though. If I can get a good infinite boner build going, that'd be sick. Excuse me, sir. Oh, he's hitting behind me again. Can kind of be cheeky. The only problem is... He's a bit of a turd. Because that attack likes to hit behind a lot. Yeah. I just gotta stop being cheeky to him. I gotta respect him. But that's the hard part, you know? It's like, I don't want to respect him. I hate this kid. Still clipped me. You little bastard! Damn it, dude. I am mistiming all of this so badly. He's just getting free reign to do this to me. Quick. Do big boom boom now. And die. Do this first. Just jamming my right trigger. I wanted to keep the kaboom from going off. Yeah, I just gotta like actually play his game a little bit more and be more patient. That's the main issue, is I'm not being patient enough. Yeah.
Darn. And for the love of God, don't forget about jumping there. Because I forget about jumping all the damn time. Had to stop my dog. My dog came in. I had to quickly pause and stop my dog. And I lost track of the, where I was in the sequence. Nope. No, sir. Nah. Whoa, you trying to go up on me? Nah. You cheap little... I fucking hate this guy! That was weird. That was really weird, dude. Yep, yep, yep. I'm just taking advantage of all the burst I can get in, man. I'm just gonna take advantage of the burst. I'm just gonna burst him. Nah. Did he disappear? He did. Nah, take this. Burst him, burst him, burst him, burst him, burst him. Ow! Nah, kill him. Kill him before he can do it. Kill him before he can... Fuck, fine. I can't hurt you during this, can I? No. Think I care? Get him! Harvest his soul! <laughs> yeah, Reaper kind of kind of just says screw you and just kind of goes a little bit a little bit overboard. Um Scapula might be the one to take because it's a pretty vanilla build. No, don't care. Vertebra is kind of like it's the okay version of the scapula. I kind of prefer the scapula. No. We're not using statuses. No. Uh, we're not really... My crit chance is dog water. We're not doing crits. Nah, we're just... Whatever, dude. Let's do a tried and true basic boy reaper build. This is fine. This is fine. Look, I've still got the voodoo doll. I've still got last resistance. I could have literally just... I don't know. Sandbagged that fight. I'll sandbag this fight more probably because now I know I've got a lot of a lot of stuff backing me up. I think it sucks that that physical skulls get the cudgel though, which is just this ludicrously, insanely powerful effect. When you lose one life, you just gain so much in defense and, and offense. Meanwhile, what do I get? Voodoo doll. What's a voodoo doll do? Oh, you know, it it, it does a thing, kind of. I warned you, old man. I told you this was gonna happen. Damn, dude. He's getting bullied! Take his lunch money! Damn, he actually just couldn't... Damn, he couldn't do anything. Damn. Damn. Okay. This is good news. This is good news. This is very, 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 very good news. It's so easy being the Reaper. You know what my greatest fear is? Is realizing that Arklich might struggle and suffer on this fight a little bit more than I want him to, just due to the nature of how Arklich plays now. And I really don't want him to, all right? I really don't want him to. I want my boy Arklich to be good, but Arklich... You know, I'm, 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 I've been a bit of a, a down player on Arklich, you know, here and there. I've, I've said that Arklich wasn't, you know, as amazing. He's, he's good, but, you know, I think now more than ever is a great time to remind you guys that he is not the same as he used to be. He's not, he never was, like, technically speaking, as safe as Reaper. And weirdly enough, over time, 
the more safe your... Did I end up getting sucked back into that? I thought I was on the other side of the screen entirely. Weird. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. No. But he... Nowadays, the more safe the skull, the better the skull, right? Reaper is safe. Thief is safe. I'd say Thief might be better than, than Arc Witch these days. Just, just from, like, an objective perspective, just looking at it as, you know, what are their strengths and weaknesses? And I know that sounds crazy to some, but in today's skull climate, it just feels right, you know? Oh my god, you can you can attack him while he's paused? You can't kill him, though. I thought you could actually kill the damn thing. Yep. Nah. 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 <laughs> nah. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna scoop all these up. Drop another one. Oh, okay. No, we're not. <laughs> I did harvest. Oh, uh, funny. That's fine. Are we good now? Burst. Oh! Dude, does he take more damage after that attack? I feel like he's more exposed and he deliberately takes extra damage if he survived that. Or it's just his heart being weak. I don't know. Maybe it's just his heart being weak. But it feels good. But yeah, going back to it, I still think Lich might be... He's not bad. Like, obviously, he's got some really good things going for him. I just don't know how he stacks up these days compared to how overwhelmingly oppressive some of the best skulls in the game can be, right? Like, I'm, I'm not going to mince words. He's definitely not as strong as, say, Heracles is. And Heracles has been out for a matter of a couple of weeks. And Heracles is already stronger than one of the most og of OG legendaries, you know? Reaper and, and Arkelich were the two original boys, you know? They're, they're the brothers in arms. The two best balanced boys. Well, some of the best balanced boys. At the time, back in early access, yes. But these days? I don't know, man. Tell me if you think Arkelich is, is as good or better than some of the boys we have now. I don't think so, but I'm keen to get in and do an Arkelich run. Maybe test out Bone, which may or may not be a good or a bad thing, depending on how bad Bone is, up fully upgraded, and if I can get infinite which is the most important bone for me to find. Oh yeah, 44 minutes. And that's including all my, my dicking around. Yeah, that's pretty good. But with all of that said and done, I've got to get out of here. Reaper is still amazing. Who could have guessed? And I will see you all next time. Have a good one.